What's the big accomplishment? So my peak would be we've been with Taylor since October. And, you know, we want goals. We want to build a house. We want to get a new vehicle, blah, 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 blah. So just recently, my husband was like, let's just, you know, see if we can cut down on Taylor, you know. And, and of course, my anxiety. Maybe some of y'all know, some of y'all don't know. But, like, I started crying. I didn't go to gym for a week. I started freaking out. Freaking out. I'm like, I can't do it on my own. I can't do it. I can't do it. And then I finally, like, the whole week I took a moment to myself. And I'm like, okay, you can do it. So I sat in my bed instead of watching TV. I sat in my bed and I looked through all his stuff. Blah, blah, blah. I'm like, okay, I can do it. So I started making my own plans. And I started going to the gym. I've been going by myself. But I was like, it feels so good to know that. Taylor has brought me to where I am. Man, you're about to get soft. <laughs> <laughs> you're not soft. You're not soft. That's strength. If you could show emotion, that is strength. You know, a lot of people, they're soft because they can't do that. So they, you know, they react to other things or they avoid it. But, yeah, it's, it's all good because it's, you know, it's coming from the heart. So don't think you're soft. I mean, I cry. I try not, I'll try not to ever cry I'm on just camera. do that. <laughs> yeah, yeah, there you go. There you go. Hey, buddy. Yeah. Um, I think just knowing where I came from and from not doing anything to being able to go myself makes me feel really good about myself. I mean, I think that would be my peak. Hey. My pit would be, I mean, I stopped going for about a week again. I know I keep falling mm -hmm. off a lot, but I just need to process what was going on. Yeah. Yeah. It's okay to take a break. It's just not okay to give up. So those little falling offs, they, they teach you each time. And each time that you fall off, you're able to, you know, process why you fell off. You feel bad for falling off because it's an action. And then you get to some action and you come back and you realize I fell off because of this and because of that. And so now you've been through that. And so now you're able to tolerate that pain, that threshold. And so you can move forward from it. So don't think that the falling off is a horrible thing that happened. That's a failure that taught you something, you know, because... We learn so much more with our failures compared to our wins. It's easy to win, you know? Winning, I mean, if you don't ever fail, you won't ever learn. If you win and you never learn, you know? If you're not chasing nothing or if you're full of food, you're not hungry. You're not, you know, achieving the next thing. So that's good, you know? Lainey, she went from a program workouts to me telling her every workout to do to downgrading um, to the monthly Build your own workout plan. And so that's what she was talking about. She didn't have me um, these last two weeks. And so she's just been building her own program based off of what, you know, feels good for her and her low back and all that. And she was nervous about it. But her and her husband, uh, Brian, wanted to go, you know, on his own, do his thing. So and that's what they did. And uh, Lainey was nervous about it. But, you know, she's able to... Um, handle that and we're always going to invite them back in because you know they went through the 90 days over 90 days and so they'll always have a place with us to come in here and share their wins and their losses and um a lot of people have come to me through them um they've inspired a lot of people so i think that's really cool um you know everywhere you go they talk about laney they talk about brian i've been on a lot of calls and they're blown away by their progress so i mean they'll always be a part of us and so I think for you to be doing that on your own, it speaks volumes on, you know, what this group is doing and helping people do that. So we're glad you're here. We're glad you came uh, jump in and, and shared that with us. You have any other questions or anything else you wanted to add? No, I just feel accomplished. Like, at first I did feel like shit because I was like, man, I can't do this with Taylor. No, I can't do it. It's like breaking up a relationship. And then I'm like... <laughs> And I'm like, you know what? If he, if Brian doesn't be like, put his foot down and be like, come on, like mm -hmm. he even had confidence in me. He's like, you know what you're doing. You know what you gotta do. Go in there and do it. Yeah. And he's so blunt. I'm like, yeah. Said a lot of words. Hey. Said a lot of yeah. words. But I was like, okay. So I went in there and I was like, damn, this really isn't that bad. Mm -hmm. But instead of having Taylor, am I doing this right? I gotta look for myself and do my own research and figure it out. Okay. On top of being a super mom while Bryant's away. So, I mean, you got a lot going on. You got to look at, at everything you've accomplished to even get to the gym, you know, dealing with him and, you know, 
him doing burpees while you doing workouts in the backyard you know like all that plays a part and you look so far what you're not doing compared to how far you've come so we always want to look back every now and then and measure backwards you know most people when they do that they live in the past and you know okay. they 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 just buried by all their trauma and they never move forward but it's okay to take a glance back every now and then and see where you were so i mean i think it's very impressive for you to do that and um you know it's you just winning now and brian being blunt i mean i don't know i don't it wasn't my fault for sure but he's doing good and i'm glad he's on he's killing it on his own you know i ain't talked to him much but i'm sure he's still serious and intense so that's good um let's see brooks brooks what we got man what we got